Alrighty. Wait, everything is good? I think everything is good, sorry. Just want to make sure Lilybot is connected to the chat. Hello, hello, hello. How you guys doing? My counter is a little bit off. It was supposed to be at 4704. All right, cool. Uh, Destiny, you're doing a Neptos slash what? Guys, the shinies are one per stream right now. You can get one on this one and then one on the overnight one. Hoopa is a mythical and is not allowed. Yeah, I uh, got a random shiny gulpa today through random encounter through eggs or how shadow destroyer. And ow, I just hurt myself on my uh, mic. My, uh, Mike has this like big metal arm stand, uh, scissor arm thing, and I just like touched it, and it's got like an end that's not really like a... It's like poking out, what the? Oh, this is not metal actually, this is plastic. It's like a clip that goes on the mic, and I'm like, ow? It was a mistake, I got Shiny Articuno, it was through a wormhole. Well, lucky you, we still don't have ours yet, unfortunately. and why oh okay was it through friend safari or ran oh, random horde okay yeah no i see the first message i was like an x and y i was like okay well that tells me what game but not how what method uh which gender is shiny meow stick for meow stick it's a special case you have to name it something uh thank you for bringing that up let me just find my uh, psychic types real quick uh psychic 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 Okay, there's Psychic, and then Meow Stick should be in Gen 6. For Meow Stick, you either have to name your Deli Bird male or female. Don't use the filters, though, like the gender filters. Just name it male or female, depending on which you want. Alrighty. Hey, is there any shiny here? Hello, uh, Rich, how you doing? That is psychic is allowed on the GTS except for the uh, mythicals. So yeah, Lugia is allowed, uh, Mewtwo is allowed, not Mew because Mew is mythical. Uh, hello, Captain Anime. So I want a Meow Stick. Do I have to put gender? If you want to specify gender for Meow Stick, please name your deli bird either male or female. Just the word male or just the word female, and don't use the gender filter because uh, Meow Stick is a special case. Uh, hi, hi, Frank. How you doing? <laughs> Uh, Celestila is not psychic, but I think you might be thinking 
I don't know if you're thinking Cresselia. Cresselia, sort of. You know, they both start with C and they have long names. That's the psychic type. We can finally get Gallade. Yes, that is right. That is correct. Uh, Slowbro is on the list for Psychic. Anything that is a Psychic type and not Mythical is allowed today. post in discord usually usually uh usually cupix does the post so sometimes i forget to and uh the live bot does take a while to do that so i'm gonna make a post real quick it won't be as detailed as something that q does though because uh she has like her messages pre-typed and everything We got a thousand one hundred members on this Discord now. Hey, uh, let's see here. Who was that last person that just showed up on my screen? Uh, Nathan Chang, thank you for subscribing. Uh, Tipsy the Token Tomorrow, nice name by the way. Does the right you have max HP? I can use the HP up once but I don't know if I can use bottle cap on it uh, are you talking about the IV the IV for the Raichu all the Pokemon have really good IV so um, I don't think there's any Pokemon that really has a uh, non 31 HP IV so it should have its max HP it doesn't have max investment in HP I don't think though that you you're gonna have to use the berries or um, the vitamins and just EV train it to what you want Does anyone want to link trade as Grant Owens? If anybody wants to do a link trade in chat, you guys are fine to do it, but only trade one for one. Uh, don't do any like two for one or three for one trades. We allow one for one trades though, because those are fair. David, my night's going well actually. Nothing nothing bad to report today.
How's everyone else today in chat? How are you guys doing? What have you guys been doing today, actually? I know it's like the middle of the summer almost, so how have you guys been spending your summer? Also, guys, do not ask for Mew or any mythicals. They will not be allowed on the GTS. Let me just reset the first bot over there because she seems to be having some problem after trading with Ryan. Uh, so Galio, yeah, you can get it, but it will not be shiny. It's shiny locked. Some of the Pokemon on the stream that are uh, given out are shiny locked. So those will not be shiny. Superior best wife. Why do you keep saying that? Why do you like superior so much? Is it because it got moved to OU? I think I heard that. Uh, need name suggestions for the Gulpin. Male or female? Oh, someone got a uh, Raichu. It's actually really cute. Well, Cream, I hope you enjoy your shiny Raichu. A Lolan Raichu. Hello, Shoto! How you doing? Uh, female... Female Gulpin. Does anyone have a... Um, a nickname for a female Gulpin that's shiny? Any good suggestions? I know this would like not make sense because uh, <laughs> um, because she's not like pink or a, a boy. I think Kirby's a boy, but you could name it Kirby. <laughs> the boy Nat is here. Don't die today on us. Uh, don't die on us today, Nat. See, my English is all messed up, man. Name it Gulp, Gulpy or Guppy. Guppy sounds like it's a little fish. Big Mom. <laughs> Oh my god, big mom. <laughs> I remember I had, I had, um, when I was a kid, I had a Hippowdon that I named Big Mama. <laughs> After the comedy movies. Stop war. Uh, name a Delphox Rain D. What? Are you going to do Wi Fi Battles PS? Uh, when I did the queue last time, my name never shows up. I think it's still like I saw your name in the list, but like people's names scroll through of how many people are entering. So it might have just like uh, missed you visually, but you were still there. I'm trying out OU, but everything feels like it hits too hard. My Toxapex got too shot by the star after. I prefer Toxic Stall. <laughs> Why aren't you just Baneful Bunker? I mean, you still get two shot, but... Uh... You still get two shot, but... Uh... You at least poison it so it can't stay for long. But then again, that is Star Raptor's role. Just to come in, swing, and die eventually. I am using the shiny charm, yes, but it probably doesn't feel like it or look like it, huh? Oh, hello. How you doing? Not Celia. I mean, you could have just changed your name, I think. I don't think anything would have happened if you changed your name. Not Celia, please. <laughs> um, gonna guess you're gonna get a shiny around encounter 5,000. That's what I was aiming for, to be honest. Hello, how was your day? Hello, Shoto. Um, it's good. It's cool. Uh, there was a big storm earlier, so there was a lot of rain, and now it's actually really breezy and chilly here, so I'm enjoying the cool temperatures. I don't like the heat. 
as uh, you also don't like the heat. <laughs> so, oh, yeah, at least for the first half of a Boku no Hero. Uh, Ian, if you want to vote for what types we're going to do next in the future, please join our Discord server. We have uh, polls on there every weekend to uh, decide what types will be on the GTS the next week. Uh, how much longer will we be streaming? Probably the full two and a half hours to three hours that I do. So, I mean, we just started like 15 minutes ago. Uh, what Pokemon would you use in a Trick Room VGC team? I mean, I don't really play VGC that much, but I know Amoongus is everywhere. Uh, what about Porygon 2? Porygon 2 is bulky and it's slow. I don't think it'd be a bad mon. Uh, how do you have three screens? I have three 3DSs. Yeah, easy one. I have three here doing the shiny hunt, and then I have three on the side over there if you want to join our uh, psychic type GTS giveaway on the side. Uh, what if you want a specific gender Pokemon? You can just use the gender filter for any gender that you'd like. The only time this doesn't work is when you're asking for a uh, shiny meow stick. If you want a meow stick of a particular gender, please name your deli bird either male or female and don't use the gender filter. If you were only... Wait, if you were only... If you were to only have one shiny, what would it be? I would pick I would pick shiny Espeon. If it's just based on aesthetic, I like shiny Espeon from the old games though. Like if you've seen his uh, his sprite from Generation Five and below, he's a really bright green color that I like. And then in Gen Six, they kind of made him a murkier green, so I don't really like him as much. But yeah, that's purely based on aesthetic, and I probably have the Espeon in a luxury ball because I thought it looked fancy. Uh, aside from that, if you guys want to know like. Pokemon that I'd like IRL would be Latios because I can fly on it, can go places, it's legendary and favorite Pokemon, so that's always a fun question. Uh, sorry, don't have it, it's not available. Okay, which other question? Favorite shiny is Rowlet. Pringle, do you like just Rowlet or do you also like its evolutions when they're shiny? Ah yes, you can get Latios because today is Psychic Day. I was link trading with people from the plaza and I got a darker special event, Sceptile. Uh, Deoxys, Arceus, and Marshadow. Wait, is it a darker special event or a Sceptile special event? Which one did you get? Uh, Sudlush, what are you talking about? How am I trading people or how are other people trading in chat? Uh, what about Wobbuffet? What about Wobbuffet? I think Wobbuffet looks cool as a shiny. The the female Wobbuffet with the lipstick is a little weird for me though, but um, I think Wobbuffet is a funny Pokemon. When you're free, uh, please transfer the Nevis. I still want to gamble hard with 2k. Alright. Where's, where's the, where's the, where's the, where's the, where's the... Alrighty, uh, check them. Uh, check the nebs, see if they uh, went over. Did you message me any of this on Discord, by the way? Because that probably would have been easier to keep track of.
Uh, do we use gender filter on Wobbuffet? Oh, yeah, no, you, you can do that. Yeah, that's what you meant. Yeah, guys, you guys, you guys got to be really specific with your questions because sometimes I'll be talking about another question and then I see a suggestion or something that might sound like a suggestion to a question and I'm just like, wait, what are you talking about? But yes, uh, for any other Pokemon, you can just use the gender filter normally aside from Meowstic because it's weird. It like shares the same dex number even though it's got like two different forms and it's kind of hard to like really um, like distinguish between the two in the game. So that's why you have to nickname your Delibird either male or female. Uh, let's see here. Why did you switch from Twitch to YouTube back when you first started streaming? I mean, I was doing both at the same time for a while, but I mean, if you're talking about when I started streaming on Twitch, like years ago, it was, why was it exactly? Well, I didn't really switch as to like, I stopped streaming on Twitch because I didn't have the time. And then when I uh, tried to pick up streaming again, it was really just for fun. And I did it on YouTube because um, I already had a bunch of like stuff designed, I think. And I don't know, I think the YouTube streaming platform was a lot simpler for me. And that was really it. It was just more uh, simple to use. With Twitch, it seems more complicated, but everybody likes it a lot more. So, like, at one point, I do want to go back to doing dual streams. But I don't know if I'm going to be able to. You know how Wobbuffet with Shadow Tag ability is banned from competitive battles? It is? I thought that was, like, abolished a long time ago. I remember it was an Uber. Uh, that Wobbuffet was an Uber in, like, Generation 3. I don't remember if it carried over any anywhere after Generation 5. Let me check, uh, Smogum. Boba Fett. Uh, it's never used. It was Uber in Gen 3, Gen 4, Gen 5 was underused. And Gen 6 is PU and so is Gen 7. I mean, it's a fairly, fairly predictable Pokemon. Like, all it's gonna do is just lock you into... Lock you into battle with Shadow Tag, tank a move, and then... If you don't have any setup moves, you're gonna have to do something to it, and then it's just gonna mirror coat or, um... It's going to mirror coat or uh, counter you and KO you. And then afterwards, if it has any like special berry to boost its speed or something, you give it priority, it'll just destiny bond. And then your next mon will also get KO'd unless it starts setting up on it. Uh, the PSS was a much more convenient trading and like online system. Honestly, I don't really care too much for the Festival Plaza, even though I was the biggest fanboy of the Join Avenue in Pokemon Black and White 2. Like, I really enjoyed it. I spent way too much time at it, like, leveling up my facilities, but I think it was because it was offline. I didn't really have to do anything with online play. Unless people you traded on the GTS negotiations, they would show up and, like, make shops in your, uh, in your thing. But I think that was a good separation between online and offline. I really do miss PSS though, like everyone says that it was like the best thing ever, and I agree. Uh, if I leave an Ultra Wormhole without encountering the Legend, can I encounter it again? You can even like KO the Legend and it'll still be there. The, the thing that triggers like not encountering the same Legend again is, um, what do you call it, is catching it. So like if you go into a, an Ultra Wormhole and you find a Raikou, uh, if you catch it, you can't encounter a Raikou ever again, but if you just run away from it or KO it, then you can. I would just leave, honestly, like, save before I see the Legendary, and then just, like, leave. Unless I'm, like, shiny hunting it, then I just want to keep encountering it until I get it. Uh, yes, you can get anything that's on the prize list using the exchanging of uh, Nebits. Uh, Frank, are you still looking to do an exchange right now? I can see if Nat's still alive because he came in before. Uh, Cold Soul, going for that Rocario. Wait, what? Lucario is a fighting steel fam. He's, he's not psychic, so you can only pick things that are psychic.
already. Hold on, I gotta do a Discord commander real quick. Uh, Discord. Remember, guys, if you're not already in the Discord, please join the Discord, and uh, we'll be putting a bunch of information and announcements and stuff. And there's a thousand one hundred members on it, so it's getting pretty pretty big. I don't know like what the size of a big uh, Discord server is, but we've got one K members, so. And, you know, it's a lot bigger than it was before. You used to be only with like 500 or something. Uh, Darmanitan, no. Darmanitan only gets its psychic like, typing from the other form, and I think it's only on my fire types. Let me check. Uh, we have. Cresselia, Muna, Musharna, Sigalith, Gothita, Gothitel, Solosis, Duosion, Reuniclus, Elgium, Bohemian. Yeah, no, it's not in here. Hello, Caitlin. Uh, which do you think I should go with, Gallade or Latias? I would go with Latias because Latias is part of my favorite duo of Pokemon. All right, now see if you can help out uh, Frank. Our boy Frank over here would like to do an exchange, I believe. You put uh, Jellybird out before stream started or must just give it uh you can try to deposit early but it, if you don't know like what the type is gonna be or whatever then they will ignore you if you don't like deposit the proper type i usually don't start the bots until like right before the stream though so you might get traded like in the mid in the beginning of the stream but it's not like you're gonna be traded like two hours before the stream starts or something But yes, guys, Necrozma and its uh, things that it fuses with uh, Solgaleo Lunala are shiny locks. So if you guys want to ask for like Solgaleo or uh, Necrozma, it will be shiny locked. Do you have a Solgaleo or... Are you talking about Solgaleo and Lunala? Yeah, uh, Solgaleo should be in here because he's psychic. Um, Lunala was also psychic, right? Like psychic ghost or something? I can't remember Lunala's uh, typing. Justin, what happened to your Nebits fam? I already had a Gallad with Gallad up for the stream, but got a cute little Alolan Raichu. What was your IGN tipsy, by the way? Because I saw somebody get a Raichu before, and I haven't seen a Raichu in like a while. Is in fact a psychic and ghost type. Okay, so yeah, Lunala, Solgaleo, and Necrozma are shiny locked. Remember, guys, don't expect shiny for those because those are shiny locked. We don't give out any of the shiny locked Pokemon. The chat is stacked today. Yeah, kind of. It's a little bit more active than uh, the other day. Not as many people, but there is more activity going on, which is good.
Uh, can I get Mewtwo with Mewtwo X moves in nature? Please answer for the time. Sorry, Jurassic. Let me uh, get that for you real quick. Where is my Mewtwo? Uh, if you name your deli bird X or if you name it Y, just a letter, you'll get the appropriate moveset in nature. But like I said, you can't get the Mega Stone because of how uh, GTS works. Ash Green Ninja is really good online, by the way. I know people like uh, rag on it because you have to like KO or something, but a lot of the times if you save it for mid or late battle, it's a really uh, powerful sweeper. Uh, how many times I need to become one shiny from your box? Wait, what do you mean? Uh, nostalgia. You just have to, if you're talking about how long the wait is, you just have to keep waiting. There are a lot of deposits. I try to leave the bots on for three hours usually. But whenever I'm shiny hunting, the I'm only using three other bots instead of six. Uh, yes, I have it, and I use it a lot for online battles because it's my favorite Pokemon. Wait, are you talking about the, the Ash Greninja or something else? Someone was talking about Ash Greninja, but I didn't see the username. Uh, are you doing your day, my dude? Yes, I am, actually. It's really cool. Uh, the rain made it really uh, chill here. We don't have any like humidity or heat anymore, so I'm really happy about that. It might actually get a little bit too chilly and breezy, so I might have to turn off either the AC or the fan. But yeah, no, Ash Green Ninja is one of my top five for show. Like, I've been using it a lot, especially with the Ash team that I have. You guys have seen it, and then I, I substituted Pikachu for Zerara, but I might go back to Pikachu for a while just to get a feel for how the team runs with him again. But yeah, no, with, with Zerara, it's actually really, really good. And I like the different set that uh, my friend helped me come up with, with uh, Noivern. Uh, Terito, hello, welcome to the stream, how you doing? Uh, I mean, uh, <laughs> I'm gonna get arrested because I helped leak the what? The BTS fan cafe videos and Big Kit is gonna chuck me down rib, Bakari, no, don't, don't ever admit to that. <laughs> Can't say that stuff online if you did something bad. Uh, you live in the Southwest America. Um, I'm actually from East Coast. So, like, in the other direction. <laughs> yeah, uh, what if there was such a thing as a Shiny Greninja with Battle Bond? I mean, it would be cool, but I think I prefer regular Greninja with Battle Bond. It reminds me more of the anime, and that's really where my love for Ash Greninja came, because I saw it, like, battling a bunch of times, and the animation for XYZ was just impeccable. Ah, yes, I remember Destiny was saying that they are from Ireland. What time is it over there in Ireland right now? Uh, when are you doing battles? I don't really have any plans for battles today, to be honest. I like keeping it to, uh, shiny hunting sometimes, but I feel like if we get to maybe 5200 or so soft resets, then I can start doing battles. Like, honestly, a lot of people are just enjoying the battle content more, so I don't know if I should switch over to just straight out viewer battles and drop shiny hunting for a while. I mean, at the end of the day, it's just really more what you guys enjoy, but um, I don't like seeing a lot of people getting upset in chat over not being uh, battled. You know what? And Kalos are probably my favorite uh, regional anime episodes. Uh, you know what? was more of a comedy thing, honestly. It was really lighthearted and funny, but it, was, it wasn't really all that great in terms of like Ash's battle ab ability. <laughs> so that's what kind of like uh, ticked me off a bit. I liked... In terms of, uh, in terms of, like, the anime episodes, I really enjoyed Hoenn for, like, the longest time because that's what I grew up on. And then, um, for Sinnoh, I really enjoyed the Sinnoh League. The Sinnoh League was really well done until we got to Tobias. As for, um, as for Unova, I just watched it for the comedy, really. It was funny to watch Oshawa do a bunch of dumb things and then, um, Ash messing up occasionally. Once I like forgot about Sinnoh League and how broken he was, I got over uh, how dumb he became in Unova. But it was really fun. And then um, the the battle between Ash and Cameron in Unova League was really entertaining. 
Uh, opinion on the Mars Shadow movie, I loved it because of the OG times of Pokemon and love with it. Actually, surprisingly enough, I haven't actually watched the Mars Shadow movie yet. I know it came out like last year, but I never found the time to like look it up online and watch it. I, I didn't have any like nearby movie theaters that had it. Actually, I love that Riolu that shows up. I love Riolu. Is it just so cute? In both X and Y, I had two players on my team. The one from Orna and a Riolu that I caught. You see, I didn't know that she would give you one because a lot of the game was not like leaked or anything. So that's another reason why I enjoyed X and Y so much. Because it was like a brand new uh, platform for Pokemon. And nobody knew what was happening. So everything was kind of just being discovered slowly. So I went out. And I caught a Riolu from like Route 22, I think it was. And then afterwards, I find out that she just, you know, straight up gives you one. And I'm like, what? So unfortunately, uh, Corina's uh, Lucario that she gives me was boxed for most of my adventure. But I kept my own Lucario. And then I also had, um, I had the Lapras that they give you for free, which I thought was really awesome. I had my uh, my starter which was, I think I picked Froakie first time around, and then I picked, um, I picked Venusaur. I picked Venusaur as my second starter from Sycamore because I didn't like Char Y, I liked Char X, and I, I had Pokemon Y. Yes, I remember when Ash's Pikachu lost to the level 5 Snivy. I remember that the excuse was, oh, well, Pikachu can't use electric type moves. I'm like, bam, your electric type moves are resisted by Snivy. That is no excuse. Literally, the meanest quick attack would have deleted that Snivy. Even like Volt Tackle. Like, okay, don't use, like, you can't use Volt Tackle, but like, at least use Tackle. Like, just run at him the same way you would with Volt Tackle. It'll do the same damage, just minus the electricity. Yeah, no, it was really bogus that that happened, unfortunately. And then I was more tilted in Unova, actually. Thank you for reminding me that Pikachu forgets Volt Tackle for Electro Ball because why again? I mean, at least he kept Iron Tail. Iron Tail is a really good move, and honestly, after all the time that Pikachu spent trying to learn Iron Tail, it would be really dumb for him to forget it. So, yeah, no. Electro Ball ticked me off. I wish Volt Tackle was still a thing. I honestly want to see if in the Sun and Moon anime they'll run into that uh, Volt Tackle tutor that's in the games, and Pikachu will relearn Volt Tackle and just, like, forget uh, Electro Ball or whatever. I mean, Thunderbolt's a good move. Quick Attack is a good move on it i guess iron tail yeah all that's fine but i just i can't get behind electro ball like why would you have a third electric type move that is like worse than worse than volt tackle uh coco it takes some time to be traded because the bots trade from the back of the gts so if you're depositing it will uh, it will take a while to get traded until the bots get to you. The old deposits are traded first because it's first come first serve. And yeah, I heard about the Electro Web thing. I didn't believe it. And I still haven't seen it in the anime. So yeah, but everyone's telling me about it and I'm kind of upset. I have a Pika, but it is a replica of the new Ash. What, with Electro Web? Please don't.
Uh, hello, Candy Melody XD. Cool name. Hey, look, it's John Cena. What? Oh, snap. You're right. I just saw the names and I'm like, oh, yeah, it's, it's on the second screen. Hello there, uh, John Cena. I can't even see his trade anymore. He lives up to his name. Uh, yeah, I'm going to get to a certain amount of soft resets before I start doing battles again, since you guys want to do battles, apparently. But yeah, I'm getting the feeling from the chat that battles are uh, more more sought after than shiny hunting. Anybody care to tell me which one of the two you like more and why? Can't see him, fam. No, you cannot see him. Oh yeah, Nat, did, did Frank ever show up and like do any exchange stuff or what? Where is our boy Frank? Thank you for subscribing, Luke Cage587. I think that's 587. Oh, okay. Cool. Uh, you know, I wish someone will make a remix of Black City. I mean, has no one done it at all? Hello, at Decry. How you doing? And there's Amiibo and Tipsy. Who else is here? Uh, oh, snap! There's a shiny radical! Yes! Yes! I almost reset it, not gonna lie, not gonna lie, I almost did it. I almost did the thing. Yes! Raiko! Hashtag shiny hype in chat, yeah. Okay, back to back to reading comments before I like explode. Um what do I do first actually? Let me uh, let me switch the screens real quick because I I want to show off the um, the Raiko here. Is that it? Is that, is that the Raikou? Yeah, that's the Raikou. Okay, so we're gonna capture this thing. Uh, let's see, what have, what else have you guys been seeing in chat? Timid, 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 please. I heard that Modest is better, but is, is Timid still good? I heard Modest is better for whatever reason, but yeah, it's a cool orange taiga. Where is my stylus? Does anybody have any suggestions for uh, what ball I should use on this thing? All right, yeah, sorry. Wait. I gotta move my mic. I moved it for no reason. That was my bad. Uh, he does need the speed, huh? I thought it would be modest, to be honest. But yeah, I, I do have my timid synchronized Alakazam here. Anyways, uh, quick ball. You guys want me to try the quick ball right off the bat? Alright, let me try that. Let's see what happens. It is still the first turn, and I can totally risk this right now. Wait a second. Wait, no, no, no. Okay, so uh, I forgot this was the save that I had the Blacephalon in, so my <laughs> my um, my Parasect is fainted and my Blacephalon is asleep with 1 HP. That's great. <laughs> yeah. Uh, someone said an Ultra Ball. Ultra Ball does match. I'm going to try Quick Ball first, I suppose, because it is the first turn. See what happens. All right, I'm going to be taking... Uh, uh, then do Ultra Ball. Okay, I'll do Ultra Ball after that. Uh, Fast Ball is also another another suggestion. Uh, a couple people say Ultra Ball if it's perfectly. What the? All right. So is Alakazam made of? 
you try to paralyze? Is Alakazam made of paper or was that genuinely like a modest Raikou? Because that is, wow, that did a lot of damage. Then again, my Alakazam is level 60, so maybe I shouldn't be too surprised. What did it do on me? Was that Thunderbolt? Gonna switch in my Mew. Uh, Flash Frozen is currently on vacation. She'll be back in like a week or two. Thunderfang. That was a Thunderfang. Oh, no, wait, no. Damn, Thunderfang did that much? Um, being scared, I think this thing might have a positive attack nature now. Sad face. Wait, what move did it use? Discharge. Okay, no, Discharge? Okay, yeah, okay, cool. If it was Discharge, then the special attack dream might be real. Let me just dance in front of this Raikou real quick. I think it's funny looking at Mew doing sword dance. Just whips out four swords out of nowhere. That's two Thunder Fangs and one Discharge. Let me just keep track of this. I don't want it to like uh, PP stall me and then kill itself with, um, what is that move? One Discharge and Thunder Fang two. I'm just gonna false swipe it. Now, uh, this guy doesn't get any recoil moves, does he? 95 base special defense. I mean, that's not too shabby, to be honest. Wait, wait a second. Wait a second. No, oh, never mind. I was gonna say he did outspeed me, but then I'm like, no, I used the ball. I'm dumb. <laughs> okay. I wish I could test its speed. One more, one more false swipe. Oh, reflect? Damn, what are you doing? Uh, reflect? Uh, it's one reflect. Did it use discharge again or thunder fang? Did it not attack me? What did it use that other turn? The first turn that I did a uh, false swipe. All right, now I'm gonna put this boy to sleep. Use reflect twice? Or Thunderfang twice? I think it might have used Thunderfang one extra time. Either way, I'm just gonna write that down as another move that I missed. Yeah, I'm sorry. It's hard to look at chat and then um, look back at a uh, look back on the screen and then on my uh, on my 3ds. Cause I'm looking at the monitor, my 3ds, by a note on the side. And then, um, and then you guys on chat, so it, it's kind of hard to keep track of everything. Anyways, let's, let's start checking balls at this thing. A lot of people have requested that I use Ultra Ball. It does it does look fitting. In Japan, these are called the Hyper Balls. <laughs> okay, he doesn't like Ultra Ball, apparently. Any other suggestions for uh, Pokeballs? Um, if it has a high enough speed stat, why don't we try that fastball? Somebody said fastball before as well. Foof! He doesn't like it. He woke up too. He's like, fam, what'd you try to do to me when I was asleep? That is one crunch. One crunch. Hyper just sound extra. Luxury ball, beast ball, timer ball. All right, let's try let's try luxury ball. I'm just throwing a lot of poker balls for like fun. I'm not even like trying to get like a high uh, cat rate um, on them. Wait, I thought I thought that was it. What? <laughs> Use reflect again, but it failed, fam. You are too defensive for my liking right now. Uh, beast ball level ball. Uh, uh, somebody else did say beast. Let's go for beast ball. I don't think this is gonna work. If this works, then um, 
I don't know what I'll do. Yeah, no, <laughs> he just said no. I have to put him back to sleep, though. Synchronize. Uh, what was that? Discharge again. Uh, two discharges. Let me put him back to sleep. All right, you you go to sleep. So he's faster than my uh, my Mew. So that should say that he has a higher uh, base speed, right? He should have a really high speed stat. So this might have actually worked. Uh, can you get unknown if so what level will be level 91 or higher and yes, you can get unknown unknown should be right here You can name your deli bird a letter any letter that you want and Deposit for unknown to get the letter that you want. You can also name your uh, deli bird Ah, like a h h h three h is like in the, like a scream and it'll be the exclamation point Or you can name it nani like what in Japanese and it'll be a uh, question mark unknown you can pick the shape of your unknown. Uh, use Great Ball or Super Ball in Japan. Super Ball? I mean, sure, I'll use a Great Ball. I don't think the Great Ball really goes with it. Yeah, I know my Mew is paralyzed. That's what I'm saying. But uh, Mew still has, I think, po positive. It's a Jolly Mew and it has max speed. So even at half. I think it should still uh, not really be outspread by Raikou. It really depends, though. It's level 100, so if anyone could do the math for me, let me know how much a max speed Jolly Mew would be at level 100. Divide that by two, and then compare it to Raikou's level 60 stats. I do have Ultra Balls. I could try an Ultra Ball again. Ultra Ball does kind of fit it the best, even though it's kind of like the most basic Pokeball to use in this scenario. See, there's an Ultra Ball. I don't think it's been enough turns for a timer ball, but we can try that too. Let's see if he doesn't like the Ultra Ball. Ah, uh, yes, you can ask for Metagross in the GTS. Thank you, Cody. How many soft resets did we get in? Let me check. 4,902. The answer is Gele, it may be a Nest Ball. Um, uh, the Nest Ball is a little weird. I don't think it'll actually go. Did it wake up yet? It woke up, right? What did he do this turn? Did anybody see what he did? I might have missed it. I'll just write down another turn that I don't remember. But, uh, back to sleep you go, Raiko. Oh, I did crunch, okay. Oh, I did discharge again. Thank you for telling me, guys. So, three discharges. So far, it's done three discharges, three Thunderfangs, three Reflects, and two Crunches. Um, any other suggestions on Pokeballs? Uh, yeah, you can get Latios on the GTS if you'd like. Nest Ball. Okay, I'll try Nest Ball. <laughs> I still think green will clash really badly with that orange, but um, I'll do what you guys request. Pokeball, Dusker Timer. I could rather throw a timer. Are you really going to get caught in that? Are you serious? Okay. <laughs> Just because I wasn't looking at it for a minute, I'm like, bruh. Latios is allowed on the GTS. It's a legendary, not a mythical. Uh, you can ask for a female Meowstic by depositing for Meowstic and naming your deli bird female. Meowstic is a special case because of the way it has its two forms, like, uh, being a little bit, like, different. So, uh, if you want a female or a male Meowstic, name your deli bird male or female. Do not use the gender filter because it won't work. Uh, when you're not paying attention, it use discharge. Yeah, okay. Thank you. I wrote that down. Uh, Beast Ball again. Alright, I'll try a Beast Ball again. Keep using Ultra. All right, I'll use Ultra Balls, like two or three Ultra Balls after this, because I really do want to catch it, and Ultra Ball kind of looks really sick on it. <laughs> he doesn't like it at all. He said, get me out of this. 
Yes, you can do Lugia on the GTS. For Lugia, you can do... What is there is Lugia? For Lugia, you can do regular Fallen Deposit, or if you name it Hidden, it will be the uh, multi-scale Lugia with the Hidden ability. If you name it Hidden. Some Pokemon you can name Hidden, but not every, every one of them. But Lugia is one of the exceptions. But it could still be Modest. Raikou agrees. I wait, this is green? What? No. All right, back to the Ultra Balls. I said I'd use like three Ultra Balls in a row to see what happens. I, I really want this to be in a, a color, like a, what's the word? Complementing, color complementing ball. But he doesn't seem to want the Ultra Ball. Another Discharge. That's four Discharges. Uh, based on looks, would you go for a Raichu or a Metagross? Because I like both an IDK. Based on looks, mm, I feel like Metagross is really, really cool looking, but I don't like his Mega in his uh, in his shiny form. So I'd probably go for Raichu. And plus, Raichu would be really fun in a battle, regardless. I don't think a lot of people who are like just casual would give you any trouble for using a right here and if like you use the metagross they might just be tired of seeing it in so many battles and it being like oh you and whatnot if you're not gonna mega then i'd say just go for Met metagross if it was timid it would outspeed you so it has it's all it's all good it does outspeed me when i'm paralyzed and i am jolly with max speed so that does point in the timid direction but still can't be certain. Imagine it has like hasty or some other nature that is plus speed. It's a plus speed nature, so we have a like one in what four chance of it being timid. But just the fact that we use a synchronizer for this just kind of leads me to believe that it will be timid. This Raikou better not be a troll. Bro, he is not liking this Ultra Ball. This is my last Ultra Ball before I switch to another Pokeball. I want to try another Fastball, though. See if he'll like the Fastball. I know it's kind of like corny at this point, but I really like the Apricorn Balls because they're kind of special. It's a 50% chance for Synchronize to work. That is true, but I've had it fail before. And he doesn't like this Ultra Ball, man. Could I transfer Hayden the Darkrai and Larry the Registeel from Pokemon Ruby? I mean, why not? It'd be fun to have them in the new games to actually be used. Where is my fastball? Wait, was that a uh, crit? What? Come on, dude. What? That was a critical capture, right? It, it did the little shaky thing twice and then he burst out. Are you kidding me? Bruh. What do you mean? Critical catch fail. What did he do to me? Uh, what move was that? I'm going to guess that was Thunderfang. Oh my God. Hi, Flash. How you doing? Critical fail. That's another Thunderfang. Did I miss? I think I missed my... Wow, I missed my hypnosis too. This guy is on something. This is insane, man. He just doesn't like Mew. He's thunderfanging me too. I'm paralyzed. What? Try to use Master Ball. No, no Master Ball. Uh, you can join Neb Heist, Neb Roll, and Neb Toss with Nebits, and you can also exchange from the prize list. You can do exclamation point prizes to view the entire prize list of all the shinies and stuff we have. Uh, wait, what happened? Uh, man, NYC has been the worst vacation I've ever been on. What happened? I mean, I can't disagree with you. I feel like Boston is better than NY. 
uh, crit doesn't always work. I've had that. Yeah, I know it doesn't always work, but it's just su surprising to see it. I mean, it was asleep with one HP, and I did a fastball. And this guy is fast. He's outspeeding my Mew, even though I'm like, you know, paralyzed. Where do I have a paralyzed heal like at all? I don't have anything to heal status. Are you serious? I mean, I have a roto catch. Should have probably used this before. And there's another discharge. Uh, we have to take a train to Buffalo early tomorrow. Oh, okay. Hey guys, if you want a male or female Meowstic, please name your deli bird male or female. And don't use the, the gender filter on the GTS. Fastball works on Pokemon that run away from you. Wait, I thought fastball worked on Pokemon with a higher speed stat. Really? That's not how it works? What? Either way, I'm salty about my, uh, what is it? My fastball not working, so I'm going to throw another one as soon as I can put this guy to sleep. You can use fastball. Uh, yeah, I know I can use fastball still, but uh, I thought that fastball, it says here, Ball that makes it easier to catch Pokemon that are usually very quick to run away. What does that even mean? Is it like Pokemon with a runaway ability or what? Or just um, like roamers? I mean, Raikou is a roamer from another game, but he's not a roamer in this game. Come on, Raikou. Enough with the games, man. There we go. Oh, drop my stylus. Hello. Cool, we have our Raikou now. Nope, we got it. We got it in the fastball. Okay, I guess I don't need to keep track of this man's names anymore. Not names. Uh, Pokemon moves. There we go. Uh, anybody got any suggestions for a nickname? We got um, Nyachu. I'm gonna write down like maybe 10 suggestions or something and then whenever I decide to give this Raikou out to you guys if you want like a, a copy of it then it'll have your name that you want. Thank you guys. Thank you for the congratulations. Name it Flash. <laughs> Flash. Uh, Mufasa. <laughs> Mufasa dead though. <laughs> Uh, Thor, Thor's a cool one. Uh, Thoramaru? Thoramaru. Uh, name it, uh, everyone's saying Flash, name it Shine. The, a fastball would be good at catching Abra since they only know teleport and can escape fast. I was thinking about a nickname, uh, Diego for, um, Ice Age? Diego. Like the, the Sabertooth Tiger? I think that would... Was that the same one? Uh, Shine is another name that I saw that was cool. Let me see what else is here. Oof! Zeus, Scar, Simba. Oh my god, you guys just love uh, Lion King, huh? Name it Doge. Kind of feel like to. Uh, Simbet. <laughs> Did you mean Simba? Fat Jolteon. He's not a fat Jolteon. He's very slim. Name it Jerry. Jerry is great Simba. Uh, Jerry for whatever reason. Saber. Saber sounds cool. I like Saber actually. Zusu's Dash. Thunderfang. No, I'm not naming it Thunderfang. I'm not gonna name it after a bolt. You want me to name it Boruto? What? I like Saber, even though it's kind of uh, basic, but uh, Raijin, Raijin, actually, Raijin. Raijin sounds dope. Uh, I think I'm going to go with either... Let me pick my top four, and then you guys can, I guess, vote for it. 
Maybe. Actually, hmm, do I want to name this thing myself? Because it isn't a fastball. Raijin or Saber? Name it Tiger. <laughs> Justice. Why Justice? That sounds so dramatic. Justice the Raikou. Yeah, I'm going to go with Raijin for now. So the one, the, the personal one I have will be named Raijin. Can I get the capital R, please? Thank you, Rai... Raijin. Hopefully I spelled that right. We're going to add it to the party. Does anyone want to take a guess? Uh, what about Toro Jin? Toro for Tiger and Jin for Raijin. That actually did sound cool. I, I forgot that you suggested that. Uh, who are we going to replace on our team right now? Do we have our synchronizers all good? I think I might just replace uh, our fainted Parasect. Parasect have his leftovers. Uh, send it to the box as is. Parasect, keep your food. Recover some HP. Alright guys, any uh, any guesses on natures? I know Deoxys is not allowed on the GTS. Sorry about that fam. Uh, bold nature, naive, bashful, modest, a nature will be timid. Ash is very certain it will be timid. We did have a timid synchronizer, so I guess we'll uh, we'll see what it is. Right, any other guesses? Timid, modest, gentle. Oof, gentle sounds like it'd be so minus. Uh, modest or adamant? Adamant would even work. Quiet, Kappa. It can't be quiet. I think it'd be a uh, plus speed nature. All right, let's see what we got. We have a timid Raiko. Yes, timid, timid Raiko. Raiko, one HP. I wonder which one of these was its um, its uh, three IVs that it had. I say lonely. No, it is. It is timid. It is scared to go outside. All right, we're gonna um, let's see. I'm gonna keep all these nicknames written down, and then we can uh, we can use these at a later date. Second, I still have my list of like Latios nicknames. Name it Verlissify.exe. Why? <laughs> oh my gosh, why? Does he does he like like uh, Raiko or something? Because I, I don't really watch his stuff. So do you guys know? Does he like Raiko? All right. See you next stream, Zachary. Thank you for tuning in. We have a Raiko nicknames real quick. Let me save this. Got a timid shiny Giratina, so I am happy. Oh, that's a very fast Giratina. I think it would be a special attacking uh, variant of the, um, what is it, the origin form, right? Wait, someone mentioned what? Alrighty, so what do you guys think I should, um, I should do about the other two guys? Should I keep hunting them or change them for another legendary? Should we keep going for Azelf and Articuno or what? In the meantime, I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna go through here in this uh, Ultra Worm Hole and uh, try to get a new legendary that we can uh, try to shiny hunt for. I do have shiny charm, indeed I do. And it took four thousand nine hundred and two soft resets. Uh, Name Latios Soltal, huh? Waital. I already had some nicknames uh, ready for that, but I'm gonna use those nicknames for whenever I do the the big uh, like stream Latios uh, giveaway. Keep on hunting them. All right. Uh, I should probably go back to where is it? I, right. I don't have to use fly anymore. I'm still used to that. I gotta go back to the Pokemon Center and get my other synchronizer back. So does that mean that you will name an Ekans snake? 
Uh, Tony, for the win, uh, the Wonder Trade box that I was using stopped working for me, so I just decided to not use them. So, uh, you know, there's no fixes for them or anything, so yeah, that's why. Uh, these are some of the other Pokemon we've got. And we have Origami, the uh, shiny, shiny Cartana. And then we have, uh, this is my uh, hunting Parasect that I used for, um, what do you call it, for Blacephalon. Uh, origami, here's our, here's our Blacephalon called Kachan after uh, Katsuki Bakugo from, from uh, Boku no Hero Academia. So yeah, we, we got this guy. We gotta put him back. You know, he's our fancy Blacephalon. This is my synchronizer. We have Raijin over here. I put Raijin away real quick. And also, uh, this is my Gold Duck. I use this Gold Duck in combination with Parasect to kind of hunt Blacephalon successfully. Uh, Mew, uh, Alakazam, and Umbreon were my synchronizers. Is this my other synchronizer? This is Timid synchronizer. All right, I had Alakazam as my level 60 Timid synchronizer because of um. Uh, because I wanted to run into Blissephalon. I kind of feel like keeping Alakazam though, because he's had more luck with Synchronize than I have with Espeon. Espeon's kind of failed sometimes. Uh, we also have uh, Xana, the shiny circuitry, and uh, Crystal, the female shiny Abomas that we got from the wormholes. Uh, when most of the myths are psychic. Yeah, I'm sorry guys, I don't dictate how that happened. Where is my Gardevoir though? Oh, we still have this over here, wow. Uh, we caught a normal Nihiligo and Buzzwool and Gardevoir and oh, all oh might the shiny uh, The shiny um, Buzzwool Smeargle, normal Smeargle Alright, this is my modest synchronizer. I'm gonna keep this here uh, shiny Gardevoir Those are my synchronizers. I think I'm good with that. I don't really think I need anything else um, Maybe this guy? Nah. You know what? Let's let's retrieve uh, Parasect because he's a good Spore user. I gave him Spore, False Swipe, Stun Spore, and uh, Dance. Yeah, I had I I have a lot of like Boku no Hero references, like you know, like All Might. I, okay, the reason we named him All Might was because when I caught him for the first time, his Pokedex entry picture made him look like all buff and big, like All Might, like the pose that he was doing. And then, um, what do you call it? We had uh, Kachan, because, you know, explosions. Really freaky to think that those things on the side of its head are its eyes. But yeah, so I'm going to take this team to the next Ultra, Ultra Wormhole. Deoxys is mythical, so it's not on the GTS, unfortunately. Sorry, guys. If you guys want to know a list of all the mythical Pokemon, do exclamation point mythical. You cannot get Deoxys, I'm sorry, but you can get Mewtwo if you want. First shiny hunt, 10 out of 10. Alright guys, um, please don't bash any other people in chat right now. Let's not have that type of discussion in the chat because I don't like to be like surrounded by all the negativity of like, oh, this person is bad or whatever. So like, you know, if you, if one of you doesn't like a specific YouTuber, then you know, that's your opinion, but uh, try to just keep it out of chat. So like a riot doesn't start out of nowhere. Also, I am a little bit distracted by all of this um, Ultra Wormhole running right now, so give me a minute to fall into a, uh, an abyss and then I will go back to chat and talk with you guys. Let's see, what color hole should I fall in? I'm trying to find one of the really uh, super crazy wormholes with the, uh, like the 
three rings or two rings and like the the sword. Okay, not that's not one of them, but all right, I'll fall into that. Uh, no, all the tapus are shiny locked Ivan except for shiny uh, tapu Coco, which is not in this uh, giveaway anyways. All right, what do you guys think we got here? I'm hoping for, I mean, Yon Mega's here, but I already have a shiny Yon Mega, so maybe we also have Swallow. I don't know, what else can you get from this area? Gladle is part psychic. Um, there's a lot of trades that I have to go through, Sam. Oh, wow, Young Mega's here. Hello there. Um, so I can't really look for specifically for your name or anything right now, so just be patient. If you if you do want to see how close you are to being traded, uh, ask a friend to look for you on the GTS, like your name, your IGN, the Pokemon you deposited, and for what you deposited. And if they can find your deposit uh, closer to the back, that means you're getting closer to being traded. The bots trade from the back of the GTS to the front, so if you redeposit, guys, it will just extend your wait time. Hello, Bless666, how you doing? Alright, back in here, trying to get another shiny, uh, shiny legendary to shiny hunt. Well, it's kind of funny, we actually got the Raikou. Any special Delibird nicknames today? I mean, there's a special Delibird nickname for any of the unknown forms that you want. So you just name it a letter. And if you want the uh, question mark, you will name it Nani. Or Ah, if you want to um, get an exclamation point. As for uh, anything else, I believe there is the nickname of um, male and female for Meowstic. So for Meowstic, it's a special case. You don't use the gender filter. You just name it male or female. And for um, for Mewtwo, if you want the Mewtwo X set, you will name it X. And if you want the Mewtwo Y set, you will name it Y. I can't trade Mega Stones through the GTS, so it won't have its Mega Stone, but it will be the proper nature and move set for one of those two forms, the uh, Mega Evolutions. Ah. There are a lot of electric uh, traps over here. This is so dramatic, this music that's uh, playing right now as I'm trying to uh, dodge all of these hazards. Speaking of dodging hazards, could you imagine if like Stealth Rock was a, uh, a dodgeable thing? Like if you know, you're, they have hazards set up on your field, but there's a chance that you're, they might miss. Riding around at the speed of sound. More like the speed of light. Oh, hello there. You sense a presence that exudes its overwhelming power. What's that? What do you guys think that is? That looks like a dog. It looks like a looks like a big dogu. It looks like a Cobalion, to be honest. What do you guys think? What what Pokemon is that up there? Any suggestions? Mewtwo. That doesn't look like Mewtwo, does it? I see legs, like four legs. I think it's Cobalion. Mewtwo, really? Mewtwo look like that? Cobalion, the Dialga. All right, let's find out. Keldeo, I wish it was Keldeo. Keldeo's not here. Uh, let's see, who are you, fam? It's got... Yeah, it's Cobalion. Cobra! Yeah, so should we go for Cobalion or should we hunt something else? What do you guys think? Let me do a poll for that one. Um, shiny hunt Cobalion. Yes, and no. Got the poll for two minutes. You guys got to do exclamation point vote, and then space one or space two. If you do one, it's yes. If you do two, it's no. So just uh. Follow the rules. Wait, what the? Why are, Why is my pole over here? Why did I move the pole over here? What? I mean, I guess it's not obstructing anything, but it's kind of out of the way. Let me move that real quick.
All right, guys, do exclamation point vote and then space one or space two. Got to do vote space and then the number one or the number two. Alrighty, did we do we have a winner yet? Let me check. Uh, so yes, we're doing Cobalion. All right. The chat exploded there. Yes, it did. Let me save in front of this thing. Switch my team real quick. I forgot to heal Mew. <laughs> LOL. What's a good nature for uh, Cobalion? Jolly? What's a good nature for Cobalion? Jolly or Adamant? I'm thinking Jolly. Jolly is usually good, um, like a good nature. You always want speed over like attack, unless your speed is really that abysmal. Uh, Cobalion, what are your base stats, fam? You have 108 speed. 129 defense. I thought your attack was your highest set. You are bulky. Uh, jolly, jolly, brave. Uh, jolly, adamant. Uh, speed, man. Gotta go fast. 100% jolly. Let's go with jolly. I'm putting Mew in the front of the party, even though he's paralyzed. Alrighty, let's walk up to this thing like we own it. That might have been a little bit too much there. Alrighty. Let me just uh go back and like try to walk right next to the the area where he's encountered. Having eyes in the side of his head is a characteristic found in prey species. Therefore, Blacephalon was the rabbit equivalent in its world, hunted by a predator. What, Tyranitar? Now I just gotta change this Raikou into a Cobalion. Oh, wow, it kind of fits right into place. Cool. Yes, uh, Terrarian, you can actually get Gally today because we have psychic types. Why is Quackers asking for the shiny Cresselia, man? You're giving me Vietnam flashbacks to, um, to other battles that I've had with Cresselia. 
Alrighty, so we're good to go. Let me actually uh, reset the, the counter to zero so we can start a fresh shiny hunt. Alright, we're starting fresh from zero. We're going to start from zero. We're going to start with that. Where is my Ray Zero music? Can't start from zero without Ray Zero. Oh yeah, since we got a shiny on stream, let's do let's do our, uh, an ultra heist real quick. Let me see if Neb heist is available though. Wait, so is there, is there a heist starting right now? Lilybot didn't say anything about a heist. What? Guys, I don't think a heist is open right now. How do I reset the counter? Uh, I just change it on my app here to zero. I have negative nebits. What? <laughs> How many do you have right now? Uh, what should you name yourself? Um, can you use like English characters or do you only want to use uh, like katakana, hiragana? Uh, Nat, what did you do? How many did you take from him? Negative 9,600 and what? Nah, what did you do? Um, damn, I don't know what to name it. Uh, name yourself Ryota. Why not? Like, R-Y-O-T-A. I feel like that's kind of a basic name. Uh, Nat, can you just reward him 9,999 then? Since you, like, overkilled it. Okay, uh, Frank, you should be back to normal now. Anyways, guys, I'm about to start another... I'm about to start the Ultra High. So before we start it, can you guys just, uh... Like, say hi in chat or say something because I can give a reward to anyone who talks within the last few minutes. So if you want a reward, just say something in chat. Say hi, say what's up, anything you want. Or just do hashtag ultra heist hype or something. Anyone who talks within like the next 20 or 30 seconds will get a reward of Nebit before we do our ultra heist. Hello? <laughs> yeah, hi, how you doing? Alright, I think now we can formally start our shiny hunt over here. Wow, these are all blue. What? <laughs> kind of funny. Without the can. Wait, what? Alrighty, here we go. Do exclamation point ultra heist and then and the amount of debits you want to bet. I gave everyone a 1k reward, so please join in on our ultra heist. See if we can get anything together. This is the first reset of our new um, hunt.
Wait, what do you mean what? What did you tell me to name myself? Name yourself Ryota. Like R Y O T A, I guess. I said spam in a can without the can. What? So just spam. Spam out of a can. So I guess it'll make it easier because um, all of these are blue and they're like different shades of blue and they're shiny. So I just have to wait until they're differently colored, I guess. Uh, you have to name your deli bird male and then deposit for Meowstick. Don't use the gender filter, please. Your wonder trading shiny Audino. Let's see who can actually get that shiny Audino from you, though. Uh, bleh, nebits are used for Neb Heist, Neb Roll, Neb Toss. They're basically just like games where you can gamble with Lilybot. And you can also use them to exchange for prizes. You can do exclamation point exchange and exclamation point prizes to uh, see what you have to do for exchanges and to view our prize list. I could get a female Esper. Nickname your deli bird female and deposit for... Uh, wait, Esper? I thought you were Meowstick. Let me check if I did it for Meowstick, too. Um, sorry for Esper, 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 where are you, Esper? Uh, yeah, no, Esper is just gender filter. Meowstick is a special one where you have to name it male or female. So if you want a male or female Esper, just uh, deposit Deli Bird and uh, use the gender filter. For Meowstick, it's different because they have different forms. Also, guys, remember that Esper and every other Pokemon that said its first stage evolution will be level 1 to 10. And the evolved forms will be level 91 to 100. So if you want a baby Pokemon, deposit it with the correct filter or else you will not be traded. Remember to use the correct filter if you deposit, guys. Uh, Pokemon that are at first stage uh, evolution or baby Pokemon will be level 1 to 10. Every other Pokemon will be level 91 or higher. Uh, Poke Tips, if you want to vote on our next types, please join our Discord server. We have over 1,000 members on it, so people uh, join in, you know, trade, battle, and talk on the server. We do, um, what do you call it? We do polls. We do polls every weekend to determine the next five types we do during the weekdays. We do GTS from Monday through Friday. Saturday and Sunday we do some special theme thing and then uh, we also have the votes, the poll for uh, Monday through Friday GTSs. Uh, the difference on Ultra Heist is that uh, everything is much much higher win rate. So we have a higher chance of winning an actual, uh, what do you call it, heist. Like a big heist. Did the Ultra Heist uh, conclude yet by the way? Okay, we are 39 people. We can rob Lily's bag. We are doing the Ultra Heist. Uh, best of luck to everyone. Hope that we win. Let's see. Will only one of us win? Will most of us win? Will everyone win? Let's see. Let's see what happens. How good is the Ultra Heist? Usually rip... Uh, not good enough this time, apparently. RIP. 
Yeah, I know. I can't believe it. We have a 70% chance to win uh, an Ultra Heist like that, and we just we blew it. We basically stone edged. Minty, why? Why you do this? Uh, yes, they are some kind of currency. They're just like points that you can get for watching the stream. You can accrue Nebit's um, bleh by uh, talking in chat or winning the games or by donating. Don't insult Stone Edge. Isn't Stone Edge 7? No, Focus Blast. I'm sorry. You're right, Lasagna. Stone Edge is 80 accuracy. I'm thinking Focus Blast. Focus Miss. Indeed. We just Focus Blasted that, uh, that uh, Ultra Heist. Okay, so can we take a moment to appreciate or at least take note of how big Cobalion is? Like, he's really long, like tall. Like, what? If you guys want to know how to exchange Nebits for Pokemon, you can do exclamation point exchange and Lilybot will give you a little description of how you can exchange your Nebits. The Ultra Heist actually failed, unfortunately. Cobalion thick. Uh, yes, it is one uh, one shiny per person during uh, during the live stream, and then during the overnight, you have another chance of getting something else. Usually, you'll definitely get your stuff during the overnight, but uh, the live streams are only three hours long, so it's only for the people who've really been here since the beginning of the stream. Uh, do you watch Gundam? If so, which is your favorite? A friend of mine is really into Gundam. And he got me into G Gundam, which is like super crazy and like uh, over the top extra. And Frank, thank you for the super chat. Yes, you can abonate for Nebits. If you do super chat, most of the time, uh, Lilybot will automatically reward you with your Nebits. So that's the plus to super chat if you can't do a regular donation with exclamation point donate. Okay, uh, look at how tall Cobalion is. He, like, actually reaches the HP bar with his horn and everything. Like, everyone else kind of just doesn't touch it at all. Yeah, I still need to fix the zombie. Like I said, uh, things aren't going to calm down for me until tomorrow. So, yeah, I got a lot of business stuff done today that I had to get done. And tomorrow should be free, so if I wake up early enough, I can actually get to doing all this other stuff. Uh, somebody said, what should I name a shiny Giratina? Uh, what was, what was its classification? The Renegade Pokemon? I mean, uh, Renegade, Maverick, something that has to do with, like, uh, defecting, I guess. Sounds like a cool, uh, treacherous nickname for a Giratina. Can you imagine if you named like a Giratina something like completely unmenacing, like fluffy? You could name him Dark Lord, I don't know. Gundam is getting a live action movie, it's gonna be Garbo Bet. I mean You you could be wrong or you could be right, but uh yeah, most likely the adaptation will <laughs> will be bad but hilarious. Uh, Nitro, you have to do exclamation point exchange to uh, see the instructions that Lilybot gives you. Uh, all the Pokemon are 9,999 Nebits. You can also get, like, uh, since today is Psychic type, all the Psychic types will be half off for 5,000 Nebits. And this applies to any day where we have uh, a type. So, like, if tomorrow, like, for example, if tomorrow was water type, then tomorrow all the water types would be uh, 5k nebits instead of 10k. That'd probably be like naming uh, naming a Pokemon like your routine not fluffy. Wait, what about it? Oh, you'd name it, like, fluffy or, like, sparkles. <laughs> name it something that's, like, cute.
Uh, no, we actually got Raikou. Uh, Pringle. We just finished getting it. You can rewind the stream, hopefully, and actually see us capture the Raikou and everything. Uh, give me the Misty 2K Nevis, please, Mama, from the 99 set. Sure. Where's commands? No, that's not where it is. Here we go. It's always a pain to navigate through this uh, uh, GUI. Alrighty, all good. He's still no shiny, right? Still no shiny. What did you deposit for, uh, Shoto? Let us know what you deposited for, what uh, what level, and what gender, if that uh, you know, if it has a gender. Guys, if you haven't received your stuff yet, please let me know what level and gender you deposited for, whatever you wanted. And look at that, uh, Christy and David are both getting a uh, meow stick. Also, Steven, enjoy your shiny Yuxi. There's uh, Christy with the female meow stick, and David should be getting the male. They're so pretty. Uh, no thank you, Frank. Mama don't want to join that shower. I deposit for Latios and level 91 or 100. Yeah, it might just be that the bots are a little bit backed up. I mean, somebody can somebody look for a Shoto's deposit on the GTS? The farther they are to the back, then the closer they are to being traded. What should I name my shiny Regigigas and shiny Zekrom? Uh, uh, I have really basic names when it comes to like uh, nicknaming stuff. Regigigas could be Titan and Zekrom could be... I'm trying to think of something that resembles like a, a black dragon or something. What, are you talking about the shiny coloring or like... It's a uh, battle ability compared to uh, like how it is now compared to other generations. Raikuro? Rai like thunder, uh, Kudo like lightning, uh, like a uh, black. Sorry, I was thinking of black lightning like from uh, that one guy that Nar uh, from Naruto that has like the black lightning um, ability. Any coloring? Yeah, Jean, I feel the same way. Old Espeon was the best. It's like my favorite. Yeah, that's what I meant, right, Kudo? Uh, Still no shiny here. Uh, Swoobat is a uh, psychic type indeed. What uh, shiny psychics would we not be able to get? Anything that is in the mythicals list. So to do the exclamation point uh, mythical command and it should be there. So, uh, let's see, Mew, Celebi, Jirachi, Deoxys, Manaphy, Darkrai, Shaman, Arceus, Victini, Keldia, Meloetta, Genesec, Deancey, Hoopa, Volcanion, Magirna, Marshadow, and Zeraora. Anything that's psychic from that list. Yeah, Flash, we were kind of wondering where you've been, you've, you've been gone for, well, not really wondering where you've been gone because we know you're on vacation, but, like, we were wondering, like, why you weren't checking up on us for, like, uh, a couple of days. We're like AFK, but we get that you're on vacation. Hope you're enjoying it. I know you said NY wasn't like the funnest time, and I'm not surprised. Like NY can be really bad, but uh, at least you're going. You're going to the fall soon, right? So that that's cool. And also, uh, we caught Raiko while you were here on stream, so you didn't miss out on that. I named my female Meowstic a Lemon Fluff. <laughs> that's really cute.
So, Minty, do you have any other cute nicknames for Giratina? Cupcake the Giratina. <laughs> Uh, NHM, Natural History Museum. Oh, okay. Guys, please be patient. There are only three bots working right now, and uh, there are hundreds of deposits from what I can gather. So one of you can go on the GTS and actually look for a deli Let me know how many pages of deposits there are. That way you understand, like, uh, how many there are. Anything, if, any, if anything, I will be, um... I'll start the other bots once I reach a hundred soft resets on this shiny hunt, so in maybe like 10, 5 minutes. Just leave your deposits in and you guys will be traded soon, I promise. Sprinkles. <laughs> You know, I wish I could nickname Zerara. I'd totally nickname my Zerara like Yellow Knuckles. Cause cause uh Knuckles from uh Sonic. Mr. Hugs. Oh wait, um what about that dragon from uh, that dragon from, uh, was it Jetpack Joyride? That old game? Uh, I think, was it Mr. Cuddles or Huggles? It was something like that. Let me, let me, uh, look it up. Uh, Jetpack. Jetpack Joyride dragon name. Mr. Cuddles? Mr. Cuddles, yes! Shiny Giratina name, Mr. Cuddles. It has to be it. Dude, I love that thing. It was so great. Uh, if the Pokemon company did not allow any Delibirds on the GTS, then we'd have to find another Pokemon. But I doubt they'll do that. Mr. Cuddles was great. I love them too. Just ramming through everything with them. All right, take care, Charlotte. Thank you for joining us in the stream tonight. Rainbow the Giratina. Would it be funnier if it was like rainbow uh, together or rainbow separately? Marshmallow the Giratina. Does anything work with its color scheme when it's shiny or regular? Uh, separate, like, rainbow. Cookie, cookie the Giratina. So many great names, but I'm probably doing Mr. Cuddles. Mr. Cuddles is probably the, the best one so far, honestly. Just because it actually has a context with a dragon. I kind of want to play Jetpack Joyride again now. Yeah, dude, I used to be hooked on like random little like mobile games on my tablet. Uh, when it used to work and I used to play on it, so. Lord Snuggles. It reminds me of when I had a, um, a Jellicent, a male Jellicent that I named uh, Lord Pringles. Yes, Mr. Cuddles from Jetpack Joyride is Giratina. Uh, Cupix is at work right now, Isaiah. Flash Clan. Uh, what about other cute names for otherwise tough Pokemon? Um, I don't know. What would be another like tough-looking Pokemon that you'd just be like, 
you'd expect it to have a really menacing name and then you just call it like <laughs> Fluffles and then it just comes along. Ah, uh, rip not. Yeah, no, gotcha games seem to be your thing. Is this why you also like Xenoblade so much? Except Xenoblade for the most part is free. Lord Pringles, I am at your command. Ah, oh, dude, my um, my jealousy would be proud. Mr. Pickles. <laughs> Where was that from again, Mr. Pickles? Name your Mewtwo kitty. <laughs> Fujur? What's Fujur? What does that mean? Mr. Cuddles would be more suited for Rayquaza, but Mr. Cuddles was like, wasn't he like golden at some point? So like I was thinking because uh, Giratina has that like creamy, creamy color too, that like the golden colored uh, Mr. Cuddles had. It would be a normal Rayquaza, honestly. But uh, in origin form, Giratina's a uh, slender dragon. All right, one more soft reset before I start turning these bots on, and we can just have some convo in the chat. If you buy the Golden Cuddles upgrade, then yes, he was. Yeah, see? Golden Cuddles. You can make all the vehicles golden. Yeah, but, like, that's what I remember him being golden. I know he was green originally. Uh, Leighton Epperson, thank you for subscribing. All right, that is our last soft reset for today. I'm gonna take these bots off right now and um, actually I'm gonna take the screens off right now and turn on the bots. That's what I meant to say. I almost said it backwards. There we go. So bear with me. I'm gonna be turning on the GTS bots to trade everyone. Remember guys, sorry that the uh, trades are taking a while. If you're towards the back of the GTS, you'll be traded almost immediately once I turn these guys on. So please uh, wait. I'll be right back in like five minutes after I set up uh, the other bots to trade. So please hold on in chat. Back, Gabriel, how you doing? Thank you. 
Alrighty guys, all the uh, the bots are uh, set up right now, so you guys should start seeing more of your IGNs pop up on the screen. Uh, please do be patient. There are a bunch of like pages of Deli Birds, so uh, yeah, wait uh, wait a little bit so that you can get traded. Uh, I have six bots in Nitro, as you can see in front of you. All of them are here uh, trading. We have Shade and Scar, which has received their Chinese, and let's see who will be next. Ah, Gabriel, nice. Uh, make sure you keep a deli bird and start breeding them. That's the best way to have them on hand for future giveaways as well. Anyways, guys, I'm gonna go get a little bit of food because I haven't eaten. So, BRB.
Alrighty, so I'm back. Be back for like maybe. Actually, I think I can do. I think I can do a battle of anything. Let me check how much time I got before I gotta go. Does anybody want a battle, by the way? Is anybody interested in a battle? A yeah, Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon battle. Alright, uh, Rick, uh, Gabriel, FC. You're the first person to say uh, you want a battle. I mean, my FC is on the screen right now. Let me just add uh, Gabriel. Usually what I do when I do battle streams is I'll ask for a battle first and first person who gives me like an answer or an FC or something I'll add and then I'll battle them. Afterwards, I use a battle queue. So you guys have to like do exclamation point battle to join the raffle once I open it. I think I can only say for one battle though, unfortunately. And your IGN was Gabe. All right, let's look for you. Uh, I did see Nitro second, so I'll go for I'll go for Nitro afterwards if I have enough time for a battle. Although I don't know how long I can stay though, because I do have to go pick up you from work in a little bit. And the stream's only gonna last up to three hours, so we have two hours and fourteen minutes right now. Right, let me just hop on. How many pages are there right now, Crimson Fire? Can you tell me? Alright, so the rules for the battles are, you know, uh, one, one v one, so like single battles, uh, six Pokemon each, uh, no Ubers. Uh, guys, the bots trade from the back of the GTS to the front, so you are not skipped. If you're in the front, you're just you just have to wait. Bots trade from the old deposits to the new ones. Make sure you're using the correct level filter, and if you have to spell your Pokemon's name out, make sure you spelled it correctly. Anyone has an extra shiny Terrakion over Rizion? Ooh, Fantasia, are you collecting them or something? I guess I'll use my, uh, my Ash team with Zarara <laughs> instead of, um, the usual Pikachu one that I use. I'm still on that, like, Zarara hype, by the way. He's a really good Pokemon. Like, 
Nothing. Um, he's frail but fast and hits hard from both ends of the spectrum. What's a really hype song? I mean, this isn't really a hype song, but it, it's kind of like a lively song. So let me just play this for the battle. All right, Gabe. Nice, you're done. We will be battling soon. All right, good luck to you, Gabe. All right, cool, I like it. No Ubers on this team. You have a pretty balanced team, although you're leaning more towards the water, like the not really bulky water types because they're they're kind of like sweepers, but I don't know what your Starmie uh, is gonna do. But that, that's cool, we can find out what you will do. I haven't done a multi battle yet, so um, if I ever learn how to do those and like how they work, then I'll probably do them more on stream because I believe it's four people, right? So that means that I can have more viewers battle me at the same time. Ooh, shiny Greninja, cool. Greninja goes down. <laughs> Unfortunate, but I am faster and I have an electric tech move. If you guys want to join the Discord server, please do exclamation point Discord. We have a huge following there with 1,100 members and growing every day. Uh, we do a lot of uh, interactions there. People can battle and trade in the server or play other games as well. And we do all the announcements there. So if a stream is ever canceled or changed or we... Um, we have any like a uh, different thing like a uh, any different announcement to make about the types that we're giving out on that particular day then we will do it there oof earthquake all right Yeah, Quick Claw is a really like risky item to use. It's like, what, um, one-fourth or one-eighth of the time? The Gudra missed its Earthquake, though, because I am Flying-type. Uh, okay, when you add us as a friend, do we do Battle or put your FC to... Um, you guys have to add my friend code first, and then afterwards, uh, after you do that, then I'll do the Battle command. But I did say that Nitro would be next if I have time for another battle. But from the way it's looking, I don't think I'll have time for another battle tonight, unfortunately. I spent two hours shiny hunting and then afterwards I have to go pick up Q, so that's why I can't hang around. Good night, Isaiah. Are you leaving for tonight? Metagross is mega evolving. I did not want this. I did not want this at all. At least my high jump kick will hit. I doubt that you'll get KO'd. It'll probably be yeah, something like that. And I'm dead. I am a dead man now. Ah, oh, rip Halucha. That's what a stab, tough claws, and headbutt will do together.
Wait, why are you not getting Bruxish? What's wrong with your, uh, is there something wrong with your deposit or what? Uber alert? Where? I don't think Me Mega Metagross is Uber, is it? Or did Zorara get changed to Uber or what? I want to be that person, but Mega Metagross is an Uber. It is? Bro, you're kidding me. I thought it was OU. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Let me check. Oh, wow. What? Since when did it get thrown into Ubers? What? Yo. I just learned something new today. To be honest, I've never re really been that threatened by a uh, Mega Metagross. Is Adamant good on Samurai? I think so. If you want to go for a physical set of like, uh, what is that? Megahorn, um, Aqua Jet. Uh, what else does he get that's physical? To be honest though, I feel like the the uh, the mix set of Samurai is a little bit better. Uh, Litwick, what did you deposit for? Yeah, we're gonna sack this Gudra by, uh, hitting it with the Toxic. I didn't know Mega Metagross was an Uber. Okay, so I, got, I gotta watch out for that. I got it's just, I've never been really swept by one. I maybe, like, once, but, like, it was kind of my own fault, I think. But, yeah, no, I've never been really, I guess, threatened by a Mega Metagross. I, I guess it is a good Pokemon, but I never thought it'd be Uber. Like, what? Is Lucario still, like, uh, Uber? This Gudra could possibly be dangerous though, but I think it already Dracoed, right? It's all good, Mr. Cheese. Uh, in time for what, Litwick? Oof, this Lycanroc. I don't think this Lycanroc will survive this. Could be wrong, but I am a very... Especially offensive. Yeah, okay. Gudra, good job, fam. Superstar. That's actually kind of cute. Superstar used Ice Beam. All you got, right? Just ice beams. Oh, uh, it's all good, Frank. How you doing? I swear to God, if I get frozen. Okay, good. No freeze hacks for you, superstar. Oh wow, the cleanest three hit KO. Uh, Litwick, I will still be doing an overnight stream, so you can probably get your Bruxish then. Right now, I see someone getting a Gallade, a Cresselia, and I don't see what else. Hey, how you doing, T-Tar?
crunch. Uh, I think I'm dead. Am I dead? I'm probably dead. Yep, that, that was a that was a good life I had as Gudra. I got the I got the Raiko. I don't know if you were around before, but I actually finally got the shiny hunting Raiko. Poof! This Tyranitar might be a little bit of a pain to deal with. Let's see what happens. That is a bulky Gudra. <laughs> oh, and I'm slow now. Yeah, gooey, gooey Gudra. And there's the EQ, and my entire life will flash before my eyes now. Uh, yes, Plasma. So Galio is in the queue to be traded. Actually, somebody just got a Bruxish. Hold on. Uh, DJ, you've just received a Bruxish here on the top left screen. Alright, back to the battle. Ah, okay, so you're a DJ. Yeah, I just saw the Bruxish right there, and I was like, oh wait, not that many people will ask for Bruxish, I think. Gallade is available, awesome man. I love how, like, happy Gudra looks, even though it's poisoned and gonna die soon. Gallade looks like it's fighting steel type. What, like Lucario? Gallade is dark electric fairy type. <laughs> That's three types. Alrighty, is Nitro still here? Because I said I'd battle Nitro. Oh, Nitro, you're right on time. Fam, what is your FC? Pass me that FC so we can have a battle. Damn, Nitro, you came in like strong at the perfect time. Yeah, sure. Uh, here's my FC. Uh, what's your FC, Nitro? Galade isn't three types, it's 18 types. Don't forget that mythical 19th type, the triple question mark type from the Gen 4 games. Remember when Curse used to be a triple question mark type move? Galate has 19 types, indeed. Uh, 4, 9, 5, 7, 5, 6, 4, 5, 8, 8, 2, 9. Alright, cool. Wow, that is a crazy smile on your face. Alright, let's go, Nitro. Remember guys, no Ubers in the battle. Uh, I guess uh, Mega Metagross is now an Uber. Uh, Nitro, make sure that your team has no Uber Pokemon.
Uh, what is your IGN again? Uh, Nitro, IGN. Uh, Jordan, alright. There you are, sending you a battle request now. You're from Australia? Uh, so, Jordan, you not want to battle. I'm trying to send you a battle request. Necrozma is shiny locked indeed. Uh, if you guys want to know the name of the song currently playing on stream, do exclamation point song name. Yes, uh, what the? All right, you know what? I'm just gonna, I'm gonna make do with this. I know it's a, uh, what do you call it? A Lunala thing over there, but I'm gonna make do with this. See what happens. Tell people to not bring Ubers, but uh, Dawn Main. No, it's a uh, Dawn Wings or Dusk Main, I think. But yeah, it's a it's a Dawn Wings thingy. So let's see if we can deal with this. Uh, Ubers are overpowered Pokemon. You can do exclamation point. <laughs> we <laughs> Uber police stop. You can do exclamation point Uber to see what Pokemon are Uber and. For you to not bring them into the battles. All right, let's see what happens though. I'm gonna play this out. Okay, Necrozma lead. All right, not too bad. It's Dawn Wings. Yes, it is Dawn Wings. Oof, that thing is. Uh, is that thing fast? I thought I was faster than it. What? Stealth Rock. <laughs> Why you gotta do me like this, fam? You bring the Stealth Rock.
What are you doing, mate? <laughs> Setting up like this. This is like the most scared Ultra Necrozma I've ever seen. I forgot, what does Moon Guy's beam do again? Somebody remind me. Shack. Oh, fam, you are in for a surprise. I am actually bulky. I'm not gonna lie, that uh, that actually wasn't that bad of a of a usage of it. You know, with stealth rocks and uh, setting up reflect, but uh, for some reason, Northern just did it. He did the thing. He did the thing. He poisoned it and uh. Got rid of all the things it did. Ooh, the Draco. Yeah, I'm probably gonna die here. See what happens here. Another Drake. I'm surprised you hit two of those in a row. I was hoping I'd live it because you had the special attack drop, and now this thing should be gone. Be gone from my sight, Noivern. Uh, favorite Z move for me so far is Supersonic Sky Strike. I love it on Talonflame, and it looks really extra, honestly. Like, you, you fly up, you crash down, and then you cause so much terrain damage everywhere. I think that should get rid of terrain with how destructive it is, to be honest. Uh, that is a Vicar Volt. I don't want to deal with that. Oh, uh, hello there. <laughs> Take care of zombie Pokemon. I got to withdraw. Are you like Bex? He looks kind of epic when he does that, but then he just slams the floor and then that happens. And goodbye, Toxic Cro Nope. He's alive. Inferno Overdrive, uh, that figures. It's a really cool move as well. And the Cosmo Z move OP. Are you talking about the, the light that burns the sky thing? Kind of sad that you live with one HP. What is min max damage doing to me?
Uh, hello, Reggie Gigas. Hi, how are you, fam? I know you're probably gonna live anything that I do to you, but I can always try to attack you. Uber police, head back to base. We've dealt with the Uber. <laughs> Neuvern is part of the <laughs> the Uber police. Just put a little siren on top of uh, Neuvern's head. Revenge. Uh, wait, does that hurt me more if I hurt him first? What does revenge do? Or is that only like if I KO? So that's retaliate though. Wow, I was at minus one defense and it only did that much damage. Okay. Reggie Gigas is a car. Why? Because he looks like he has a traffic light or what? Uh, Reggie Gigas should not be Uber. I can understand Mega Metagross, but I would never see Reggie Gigas on an Uber list unless they change that awful ability that he's got. He's got pretty good stats. It's just really the ability that kind of kills it for him. what <laughs> that's actually super dramatic oh i was hoping you would predict the switch rip me Yeah, this Talonflame would not have appreciated those rocks that you dropped in before. Oof, I should have seen that coming. like for McDonald's what they have those now so this is why it's my favorite Z move look at how extra it is crash and all the destruction it looks like a giant meteor My boy, my boy is going to be the sacrifice right now, most likely. My boy, Halucha, it was too soon. The world was not ready for you. Thank you, Litwick. And you're very welcome as well. I'm probably going to be dumb right now and hit it with a water shark. And I don't think this will KO, but I'm hoping. I mean, well, you know what? Yeah, you know, it'll KO. I didn't want to risk a hydro pump missing. Yeah, no, uh, Talonflame was my hatcher for a while until I switched to Volcarona because Volcarona's uber cute. And then, um, what do you call it? Talonflame was really OP in Gen 6, but back when it was OP, I can relate to you not using it because I used to use Star Raptor more. And now that, like, Talonflame's been nerfed, I'll be like, nah, our boy's still good, and then I just use him in this team. But, you know, having two priority, uh, Brave Birds, essentially, is really handy. 
Just rocks. Rocks suck. Rocks always get me with him because he's quite a weak to rock and then he takes half his life from stealth rocks, which is really bad. But thankfully, uh, I'm still deciding whether I should run, uh, what do you call it? What is that called? It's, um, Defog or Tailwind on my, on my Noivern. I like Defog for rocks, but then I like Tailwind because it makes everything I have faster. Alrighty, well that was a, uh, a good match. That'll be my last match for tonight. Uh, good matches though. I like using my Ash team, but I am having some teams being developed right now and I'm testing them out with a friend. So you guys can expect to see me battling with other things that I like, like I guess uh, Pokemon that I like um, personally, as opposed to doing a theme team. Although I do want to try out an Alon team because he did win the Pokemon League and his Pokemon were kind of OP. He's got a Metagross. But since it's not Mega, it's not Uber, so I have, like, Charizard X, Meta Metagross, uh, what else? It was, uh, Metagross, uh, Charizard X, Tyranitar, Weavile is OU as well, B-Sharp is kinda mad, but he's a cool Pokemon, and Unpheasant, Unpheasant is probably gonna be, like, the funniest one on that team. Alright, anyways, the stream will be live for another 11 minutes, and then I'll switch over to the Overnight in a little bit. I hope a lot of you have been traded. Is there anyone who's been waiting like for a really long time to get traded? 